All right, in order to eliminate one of the variables using addition, we want the coefficients on either the x's or the y's to be opposites. We are going to be using a least common multiple type idea. So, in order to eliminate the x's, we're going to multiply the top equation by 2 and the bottom equation times 3. Here's what that looks like. Negative 3 times 2 is negative 6. 4 times 2, 8. 16 times 2, 32. Bottom equation, 2 times 3, 6. 3 times 3, 9. Negative 5 times 3, negative 15. Now, we're ready for the addition step. Negative 6x plus 6x, 0x is. 8y and 9y, 17y. 32 minus 15, 17. We have 0x's. They have been eliminated. Now, we solve for y. Divide 17 to both sides. y equals 1. So, our y value of the solution is 1. Now, we need to find the x value. You can use either equation if you want to. I'm going to use the bottom equation. I'm going to rewrite that, but instead of the y, we're going to write what it's equal to and that's 1. So, go ahead and do the multiplication. 2x plus 3 equals negative 5. Subtract 3 from both sides and then divide by 2 to both sides and so, the x value is negative 4. So, negative 4 comma 1 is the ordered pair that makes both equations true. Just something I want to tack on in the end here. If you wanted to eliminate the y's, one way of doing that is multiplying the top one by 3 and the bottom one by negative 4. And now, notice we have a negative 12 and a positive 12 as our coefficients. So, after we do the addition, we have 0 y's and they've been eliminated there. Bring balance to the force, not leave it in darkness.